What's happening now, Riders? So, I'm still here playing catch up with Ruby Chibi. I am almost fully caught up. This is Season 2, Episode 19, Steels and Wheels. Not really sure what this is going to entail, but as you know, I am doing two episodes per reaction so that I can catch up. So this is going to be Episode 19 and Episode 20. And then, uh, later on within the week, probably on Thursday, is when I will be completely caught up because I will be doing episodes 21 and 22, which will make me fully caught up on Ruby Chibi. So I'm almost there. So let's get this started with episode 19. Let's go. Ruby Chibi! Look at Yang. <laughs> She got the so itis. Uncouth. What? I'm plenty cooth. I've got cooth coming out of my ears. Hmm. You know mm. what your problem is? What? I'm too awesome? I make this look easy? I care too much? You can stop me anytime. You're a tomboy. What did you say? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You should try and be more of a lady. Like Ruby. She's so sweet. Always trying to make others feel good. Maybe we should talk about something else. Uh-oh. <laughs> Does anybody want a cake? I can make a cake. And Weiss, she's way more cultured than you are. It's true. I am. <laughs> Nora, the way she poops you on the nose. Oh, Just adorable. Right now, you are not adorable. Like, at all. Get it together, girl. Who she's knows? about to go fuck him up. I might even ask you out on a date. <laughs> Boop. Well, I think she's adorable. <laughs> I mean, she punches shit out of that. Boop. <laughs> Are you feeling oh, slow and uncool? I'm listening. Cause why? Take a shot of too much quick energy drink. It'll fire you up fast. <laughs> Look at Curl in the background with his speedo. <laughs> Come on down, the crazy Romans. We're in sing deals on wheels. Mad as a hatter. You can. No Our credit, no problem. No money down, problem. Oh shit. Have you been injured by toxic energy drinks or defective motorcycles? Shameful. <laughs> I'm Roman Torchwick, and I will fight for you. I'm loving these commercials. My clients now. Oh, this will be satisfying, all right. Uh, uh, call for a free consultation. <laughs> 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 oh god. Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? Oh, oh shit. No. I was afraid this would happen one day. I've got rogue. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, he said he's gone rogue. Oh, they're gonna throw the book at me. Maybe even two books. I have to stay in stealth mode. Hey John. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? Did he just pack his Y? I have to start a whole new life. I know. I'll call myself <laughs> Felipe. Do I even want to know? <laughs> I'm a fugitive friend. Public enemy number one. A man without a face. My home is tonight. <laughs> also, call me Felipe. That's my thing now. Hey, is Jean in there? Do you mean Felipe? <laughs> I'll never forget your help, my friend. But you must forget me. I was never here. I now join the underworld. Was I supposed to tie that to something? <laughs> Yo, Red, you seen John? He forgot his wallet at the store. You'll never catch me, Johnny Law. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you know what? To be brutally honest with y'all, I did that once by sheer accident. Like, I was at the store and... Um, you know, I was just doing some shopping. I don't remember everything I was buying, but I do remember, like, I picked myself up, like, a, a pack of gum. And for whatever reason, I just put it in my pocket. 
I think I either had on a hoodie or like a coat or something and I just put it in my pocket I don't know if it was just by like instinct because you know years ago like I always used to have gum like always had gum in my pocket so I don't know if it was just by pure instinct because I was holding gum but I just put it in my pocket went to go buy everything and I'm walking outside and I'm chilling and I put my hand in my pocket and I was like oh shit oh <laughs> you know it was like that and you know I took my ass home and had a new pack of gum I wasn't gonna turn around and go back to the store like it's not logical. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Let me set this next episode up. Uh, Alright, so this is going to be episode 20. Um, What's it called? Monsters of Rock. Okay, so I know based off the thumbnail, this has something to do with like a band and rock and roll. So I'm very excited to check this out. Ho hopefully this is hilarious. Let's go, y'all. <laughs> I'm still not happy about this. A civilian has no place in junior detective business. I know, partner, but the junior police chief says it's good for PR. I'll try to stay out of your way. Just remember, kid, if anything goes down, <laughs> we can't guarantee your safety. <laughs> Sounds like a 4 7 niner. A suspicious cloud formation? Let's roll! <laughs> they just run over somebody. We, uh, got a report. Of a hit and run. <laughs> Investigating now. That is so fucked up. That's not how it works. That's You're really not how it works. Clues and solve puzzles to escape the room. Or we could do it the fast way. Are you just going to punch your way out of every problem in life? Uh, have you met Yang before? <laughs> I wonder how Crow is doing with the boys. We're never getting out of here. What are we gonna do when we run out of? <laughs> you know what has Winter? I don't think Winter has met Yang. I think you boys are overlooking an obvious solution. You mean, E. John? What? Why me? <laughs> mm, tender. <sighs> yeah, we're never getting out of here. The clue is right there. Escape code is one, two, three, four. Oh. Hey guys. Just read it backwards. Poor crow. <laughs> I did hear that those escape rooms are really Master fun, though. Genius. Expensive, what but fun. Is this mess? This. They got this grim. Trouble class. Trouble. They got grim. They got two grims. This. I can't lie. Dumbest thing I've ever heard. I can't remember the names of the different grims to save my life. Bring forth the death gun. Roman, I underestimated you. The death this guy. This is truly fiendish. The band is just a distraction, so you can shoot them all with... <laughs> <laughs> Pyrotechnics, baby. The other bands don't stand a chance. You're fired. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. That was funny. That was a short episode, but it was funny. Alright y'all, so, I guess now I kind of understand the term Monsters of Rock. <laughs> I still can't believe that they had Grimm <laughs> in the fucking band. Alright y'all, so, we are literally, well, not we, I am literally two episodes away from fully catching up on Ruby Chibi, and then Ruby Volume 5. Chapter one. Oh, I cannot wait. I cannot wait. So, my writers, post your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about episodes 19 and episode 20 of season two of Ruby Chibi. Let me know what you guys thought about these two episodes when you first seen them. I cannot wait to be fully caught up. Just two more episodes, y'all. Just two more. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction. I look forward to seeing what you guys have to say. So, until next time. Ride or die, Night Riders. We out.